We've taken great lengths to reopen a cold case to the murder of Sean Ritterson, which happened about 35 years ago. And we've come to the investigative conclusion in that case. Unfortunately, we've exhausted all of our leads, all of our forensic techniques that we now have at our disposal. And we were unable to come to a conclusion, a legal conclusion, as to who killed Sean Ritterson. Because of that, uh, I'm personally disappointed, but professionally, I'm satisfied that we've done all that we could do in order to solve this case and bring some finality to it. The case is now going to go back on inactive status. It will never be closed until we solve the murder. But at this point, we're going to have to put it back on inactive status, and if the public has any information that they'd like to bring to our attention, we would still welcome it.